We are in Belgium and we are back at one of the most awesome supermarkets in uh, Europe or slash that we've ever visited. Yes, we've been in Belgium. We've been to Plopsaland today, which is a theme park. You can check out our antics on Theme Park Life. But today we're doing a shopping vlog from uh, one of our favourite hypermarkets, actually. This is brilliant. This is actually a very special store because if you remember the vlog, it's the store where we first saw that you can split open multi-packs of drinks in uh, Belgium and buy them individually and buy them separately. So we're very excited. I've got Claire with me here. <laughs> she was waiting for me doing my intro. Anyway, let's, let's go inside, guys, and see what we can find. So they've actually got loads of really good discounts in their toy section. In fact, there's even a decent Lego set that I've been keeping my eye on because of the pieces. Like, I really like these loop elements. And it's half price, 24 euros. To be honest, guys, I'm going to pick it up for the old collection. So we bang that in there. Uh, I grabbed a bag of dots as well. But yeah, all of this stuff is like half price, which is like pretty... I mean, even the Mario starter sets and stuff, crazy price points. Ferrero Prestige, what has this got in then? So it's got the Mon Cherie. what's this thing on the left? Pocket Coffee, Espresso, interesting. Carte d'Or, Carte d'Or Cashew Bar. Oh, that's dark, I wonder if they have a, do you know what, I'd pick one of them up if they had a milk chocolate one. Do they have a milk chocolate? Almonds, almonds, milk. Oh, damn, would have got one of them. What's this one, it's got, has it got Biscoff Cream in the middle? Yeah, it's literally got, I might buy one of these just because it's got Biscoff cream in. I'm not 100% sure if that's new or exclusive to this country. Also a load of Tony's here. What flavours have they got of that? Again, I'm not sure if these will be anything special. Oh, hazelnut. It's interesting, what is this? Hazelnut crunch. Milk hazelnut crunch. Very big kinder section. I'm tempted by the countries. Should we get some kinder country, Claire? These are nice little small bars that are healthy. Not healthy, but I mean, you know what I mean. Claire, could you come over here so I, so I don't have to move? So. Yeah, I do apologise. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just yeah. It was just so that I didn't have to move, yeah, because, yeah, I couldn't be bothered to move, so. No, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, look at this, Claire. Shocker Bonds White. Pretty cool. Pop, pop and Croc. What is that? Oh, Fast and Furious Spy Racers Kinder Joy, wow. Why don't you get some of these? See if they're comparable to M&M's Peanut. No? It can't, yeah, no, nothing compares. Do you like the uh, Belgian flag version there? Aww. Yeah, that's good, isn't it? What's this? This is new. Oh, Galak Ball. Oh, is that like white chocolate Maltesers? Yeah, basically. Oh, I'll take a photo of that, people will love that. What's this big milk and max bar? What on earth is that? Nusini Choco Gufti. I can't figure out what that is. Oh, we like wafer, waffle. Hey, oh, hazelnut waffle. Ooh, hazelnut, hazelnut or wafer. I'm not going to grab one of them. Hazelnut and wafer. That might be a fun one. Ah, oh. Pokemon. Wow. Made in France. What do we have here? Soda straws. What flavour are they then? Tropical passion, iced tea, peach, cola, and strawberry. Mm. If they were slightly more interesting, I would have got them, but they're not quite interesting enough. Right, now last time we were in Europe, we got two massive bottles of Fritz sauce. And I have to say, the brand was not as good as this brand. So I'm going to buy some of this today fritz sauce this brand because it's better in fact if they had a smaller bottle i would get a smaller bottle but don't so i'll just get this bottle there we go this is our preferred brand i think we got that the first time i think we've got their own have we not huh did you just say that no i was trying desperately i was tapping forever with my fingers to get it to focus and you were going like this um, so like you moved it from there to there i was like oh no and then it's back again and then it's against your chest sorry. it's not your fault you couldn't know you couldn't possibly have known claire i'm sorry that i lost my call yeah dnl brand there we go so yeah we'll get some of that do you want any other of these ones no. claire brazil sauce well you well yeah we do sort of they got a curry one. You like the curry one that we got? Oh, you still got it? Actually, the one I got from Germany is just a... It's not like that. Oh, it's, it's not, not like, like no, it's not like a curry mayo, is it? Yeah, it's like just a proper curry sauce, yeah. 
Oh, they got a curry thing down there. What on earth is that? Oh, that just must be their own brand one, I suppose. Yeah, good. Anyway, yeah, DNL seems like a really good brand. Last time we had it, absolutely killed it, didn't we? Cowboy Dallas. Very interesting. Oh, sweet garlic for beef. Heinz there. I do recall in this store in particular, the crisp section is really good and the drink section is really good as well. So I'm looking forward to them. Also, we're, Claire and I are leaving tomorrow. Well, we're doing a, like a shopping day tomorrow. We're going to like a few different malls over here, um, but we are uh, going home in the evening uh, or the afternoon, late afternoon. Uh, so we're gonna probably grab something from here from the fresh bakery here for breakfast. Here we go, guys. This is our domain, the drinks section. What have we got? Anything interesting so far? Well, some of them, a lot of them haven't changed. Oh, or doesn't have the individual label. Yeah, but look, people have been banging on this one straight away. <sighs> Pop that in there. Bring back the two. Yes, guys, over here they sell Lipton sparkling iced tea and it is incredible and it is offensive that we don't have it in the UK. Uh, so yeah, we got a six pack because we are smart. Um, what else they got though? Peach. Oh, peach. Oh, right. I thought that was peach sparkling for a second. Oh, what's this? Mango and passion fruit. Mango and passion fruit. I'm going to get one of these mango and passion fruit because I don't remember. I may have actually had it before, but I don't remember having it. Uh, they had this one for ages, this cherry and, and raspberry and cherry blossom. Oh, they do fused tea sparkling as well, Claire. Is that what you just said? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. Yeah, well you could take any of them out. What what flavours have they got here then? Black tea, we actually had one of them at the theme park today, didn't we? That was nice. They've still got the black tea and cinnamon. They've still got all the same flavours, madness. Green tea, mango, chamomile. What's that green one over there? Lime. Oh, green tea with mint. lime and mint, wow. Nice um, branding, look. Oh, they... Coca-Cola Light, did they change the name? Oh, they changed it from zero to light. No, no, that's diet. diet to light. Is it? Well, that's diet. No, yeah, that's zero. Oh, so they must call. I don't remember noticing that last time that it was called light rather than diet. This is nice packaging. On the they got lemon and then what well, diet lemon or or lemon light, whatever you want to call it. What we've got down here? No new flavors that I can identify. Nalu, melon splash, Look, frost. Oof. Fruity Energizer Frost. I wonder what that is. Passion. I might try one of these frost ones. I wonder if there's any... Uh... Yeah, let's go for one of these. I don't know what it is, but we'll go for it. Nalu. Oh, they've got... Cheeky. They've got bloody Dr Pepper and cream soda. Oh, it is an American import. Fine. Okay, I was about to be very angry for a second there. They've got some Lay's here. I don't know what flavour it is. It says Brussels ketchup, ketchup, and it's Fries Andalus. And when I Google translate Andalus, it says just says Andalusian. So I don't know, but, because look, they've got a flavour here, which is Fries Mayo. So we know what that is, but it's this one is Fries Andalus. I don't know, Claire. Maybe it is as simple as tomato ketchup. I don't know. Quite a cute product here, Claire. Fried chicken style party pack thing. Oh, look, Lay's Pizza Hut Margarita there. Not massively into cheesy uh, crisps, to be honest. Eh? Any interesting flavours there? There's more pizza. Oh, I'm gonna, gonna get some of these. Black pepper rosemary cashews every day of the week. This brand in, intrigues me, Aquarius. There's lemon orange, red peach. Ooh, green splash, blue ice, cherry. Interesting. Is that this one? Yeah. Might get a cherry and a peach. I assume you can break these open as well. Right, this is the moment of truth. Does it have a barcode on? It's going to be in a bit of hot water if we... If it doesn't have a barcode, but let's... Yes, barcode, mate, we're fine. So yeah, red peach. Nice. We really like this brand of water, don't we, Claire? Mm. Any new... F I do. I'm not the biggest fan of flavouring. Oh. Unless it's lemon <laughs> Yeah. Well, yeah, I like them. Um, what have we had? Oh, look, lemon cactus. 
that's a new one. Lemon and cactus. Well, I mean, it's what would be rude not to, wouldn't it? Grab one then. Lemon cactus. Um, grapefruit raspberry, that sounds quite nice. Orange. Raspberry black currant, wow. It's quite a big bottle though. If they had a small bottle out, I would have probably got that actually. Pineapple ginger, I don't remember having that before, but uh, I don't want to go too overboard. Mint, strawberry mint. No, I don't 100% remember having strawberry mint before. Uh, yeah, why not, eh? <laughs> yeah, state of me to be honest. Right, here we go guys, we're moving into the patisserie section. What have we got? They're telling me to stop filming, you think? Wow, fuming. Any eclairs? What eclair is that? Oh my god. <gasps> oh, wow. Is this almond? God, what is it? Amandel. Amandel Premium. Wow. Gotta be almond. Oh, normal one's there. This is where we saw banana eclairs once. Haven't seen them again since. Bread. Oh, those bread rolls look nice. Bread sticks, rather. Butt on a bread, is that? Yeah, cheese. Don't know what those are, but yeah, one of them's chocolate stick of bread, isn't it? Oh, cranberry. Cranberry bread, yeah. Yeah, Claire reckons sun-dried tomato, cranberry and chocolate, I'd agree with that. I think that's a, a good good call there. Right, here we go, Claire. I reckon we should go in on these. I mean, we don't, we've got donuts. Yeah. We really don't need it. I suppose, yeah. Do you think we should just have donuts for breakfast yes. then? Yeah, okay. <laughs> we'll just do that. Blimey, these are nice. Clementine's still with the leaves on. Blimey, look at the size of those prawns. Hand for reference. Well, yeah, it doesn't really work. But yeah, they're massive, trust me. Oh, you can even get live lobsters. That's scary. It's like a uh, aquarium. So it's a bit, a bit less humane, I'd say. Not ideal. Any interesting ice creams? Stracciatella, pistachio. Oh, so, what's that, sorry? Oh, almond. Almond. Salty peanut. Oh, wow, M&M's peanut chills. Oh. Spider-Man ice creams. What? Ice cream. Oh, it's, oh yeah, sorry, they're both the same. I don't think there is somewhere with a more interesting and cooler logo than Bricko that actually isn't interesting to me at all. Um, oh, ref. Yeah, the ref's gone out on it, but that looks nice in the light. But uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed that video, guys. That was a lovely little perusal around Carrefour or Care Ref. Uh, anyway, thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next time. Cheers.